you guys welcome to a vlog i'm so excited we are flying to miami today and i haven't really packed yet i don't know what's gotten into me but i picked out a couple outfits i have like one more outfit to put together yeah we're going to miami today i have to finish up packing and get kind of like the rest of my life together i'm like thinking about putting a little bit of self tanner on because you know this is not really working out right now but i just want to update you guys on what's going on obviously you can tell by the title of this video it's going to be a miami vlog and i'm just really excited to bring you guys along i'm gonna try really hard to vlog a lot on this trip to get kind of back into a routine of things and yeah so good morning what's up let's continue to pack i have a lot to pack oh there's a pretty girl behind me we just played for like 30 minutes and she's so tired look at her tongue out she's so funny please look cleo girl are you tired are you tired from playing so much vlogged with my new hair yet either i got a haircut I felt like my hair was super dead on the ends and I was kind of like having a moment where I was like I'm never dying my hair blonde again because it felt so dead on the ends but it just really needed a healthy chop. I'm so happy. I feel like I love it. I felt like my hair was looking dead for a bit. Yeah, I really love it. I managed to fit everything into my like little carry-on Ramoa. This is every outfit I brought with me. Workout stuff, everything, all my bikinis underwear socks and then the side has shoes and bags that i need and i'm like so surprised that it all fit in here and then in here is all my toiletries my makeup my computer and all of my like electronic stuff headphones pair of flip-flops to change into after the plane just because i don't want to wear flip-flops right now it's raining in boston and then obviously my bag that i bring with me everywhere film camera and a sweatshirt which i don't think i'll need so I don't really know um, what to do with her. I think I'm just gonna try to stuff it in here because I don't really need that right now. I thought I did for the plane, but like I really don't even feel like putting it on. Like I think I'm just gonna wear this and I think I'll be fine. Like I don't think I'll be cold even though it's raining. So I don't know. That's so cute. I just woke up. As you can tell, I'm like not ready at all. And yeah, I'm like so excited to lay in the sun today. <laughs> I'm like literally just can't wait to be doing that all day. Peyton and I are staying at the Four Seasons, and then everyone else is staying. I think like the Ritz that's like downtown so we aren't together which kind of sucks but like we'll meet up whenever we're gonna do that so right now I'm getting ready Lexi's about to be here and we're gonna go get coffee I'm so excited to like go swimming like go in the pool today is that weird I feel like because I had extensions for a bit and you like can't get them wet in a pool or also turn green so I feel like I haven't really been like swimming which is like so messed up in the ocean too like I didn't put my head in the ocean whenever I was at the ocean because I didn't want to like get my hair extensions wet because those are such a pain in the ass to like deal with I'm just really excited to swim and get coffee and stuff 
But yeah, I just want to update you guys. It is morning. I woke up feeling super puffy and like tired. Not tired, but like we got to home last night. I forgot to tell you guys this. We got home last night so late. Like there was so much traffic last night in Miami. I don't know why. We were leaving Zuma to get to the hotel. And it's literally like the hotel. We walked to dinner. And then we were like, okay, like we're gonna Uber back. We also ate dinner so late. We like got home at like 12 30. Which is just like so insane. I hate eating dinner like really, really late. I like, can't do that anymore. I'm such like a go to bed early type person. <laughs> that bad. I feel like I sound so boring. This sunscreen is my favorite. Color Science Unforgettable SPF 50. It's so good. I love it. And it looks like it's like tinted. I don't know if it's actually tinted. It's just like a mineral sunscreen. I don't know if that has anything to do with it, but it like doesn't like cover anything on my skin, I don't think. I don't know. Let me see what it looks like on. Cause I forget. I like I used to use this one all the time, but then I started using Elta MD and I don't like Elta MD, but I used it for a bit, just like the tinted one. And then I started using this one from the place that I get my Botox and my lips done, the Lex RX um, sunscreen. But I stopped using the Luxorx one because I ran out and I ordered this one. And yeah, I guess it does add a little bit of like a glow to your skin. But I just love the way that it looks. And my secret, something that I have to do literally daily, I use eyebrow gel every single day I have to. This is the Benefit 24 Hour Brow Setter. It's like the little mini size though. I just love brushing out my eyebrows and having them stay in one specific spot on this little lululemon align i think it's the align dress i don't know what dress lululemon dress like workout dress to go get coffee and breakfast with lexi and then i have my bag and i'm doing my normal jewelry jennifer fisher hoops this little like ring bracelet thingy attached it's from capward nyc it's so cute i'm obsessed with it but yeah just got ready <laughs> I just woke up from a nap. Made a teensy little espresso shot. What? Why is this so cute? And it is currently afternoon. I gotta get ready soon. We're gonna head to dinner. We're doing like an early dinner with everybody that's here. Like Lexi, me, Maggie, and just like everybody. Um, but we sat by the pool and then I got back and took a nap. And it was so good. I'm gonna drink this little espresso shot. It's so cute. I'm about to start doing my makeup soon. So I just want to update you guys on what's going on. I'm my setup right now so that I have a tripod to film me getting ready. <laughs> I didn't really bring stuff for hair. And I don't know what I'm going to do. Well, I know that I want to wear my hair in like a... Although I did this last night. I want to wear it in a low bun with my outfit. I think you guys may love my outfit because I love my outfit tonight. <laughs> it's like so me. I didn't really bring much to do my hair. Not like I really need to, but I'm gonna do like a low bun. So I think I'm gonna do that. And I wanna like slick it down, but I don't wanna like slick it too much. It's so weird seeing me with short hair. I kinda like it. I did short hair in, I think it was 2021 and I hated it. I thought that I looked it's so bad. I needed to cut my hair this time around and I'm like really into it right now. Like everyone was just being like, I like think it looks so good and it made me be like, wait, maybe it does. Um, Because my sister always has short hair. I love her with her short hair. My mom always has short hair too, but I don't know. I'm using the R&Co pomade stick. I love this stick for my hair but i don't the thing is, is that i don't want to slick down my whole head but i do love slicking down like the front pieces like this part okay do you think it looks good because i think it looks like pretty good i'm just gonna slick some of these little flat face down I literally have 10 minutes to do my makeup. I gave myself an hour to already, now I have 10 minutes, so.
I don't know what hoops to wear or if I should use this bag in my normal Chanel bag. I can't decide. But big hoop or small hoop? All my hoops, you guys, like my big ones are from Jennifer Fisher if you're wondering. I don't know what hoops to wear. We had to buy shoes because we're walking to the game and Those our feet hurt. Look at us. They're so Wait, cute these though. Are... Why are these so fire? Wait, you guys. That's that we got, I love them. That's that's we that. got. Uh, what are they? I haven't vlogged since breakfast this morning. I got back to the hotel and went down to the pool and it started downpouring. And then after that, we were like, uh-uh, called it a day and watched OC all afternoon, so. We're headed to dinner tonight, and we are going to, I think it's called Casa Tua. <gasps> My hair. I, <laughs> whoa. Whenever I lay down with wet hair, it always gets so, like, frizz ball energy. So, anyway, um. We're going to Italian tonight, and I'm so excited about that. I'm like craving Italian. I haven't had good Italian in so long. Hopefully this place is good. I don't know. I've never been here before. And then we have the game later on in the night, so we'll make our way over there. I don't know what I'm going to wear tonight either. I only brought one pair of jeans. I brought a mini jean skirt and I brought some jean shorts. I only brought one pair of sneakers. Okay, the thing is, here's my story. So when we were on our way down here, we took, um, as you saw, a private plane. The plane that we were taking, we could only bring like carry-on luggage. They really said we could only bring soft top luggage basically. I have the only one I have for carry-on size is my aluminum Ramoa one, so it's okay. It ended up being fine, but we were only allowed 25 pounds, 25 to 30 pounds of luggage, and so I'm over here like, what the heck are we gonna do? Maggie and I are like, what? Maggie's like wanting to bring these big boots and like all this stuff, so we're kind of freaking out i make it work right i put all of my um my like, toiletries and my makeup bag in my louis vuitton bag and then i which i think i saw you i showed you guys me packing at the beginning of this vlog and if i did i'm sorry i'm repeating it but anyway i made it work right so now that it comes down to it I don't have that much stuff. So when it comes to what I'm wearing for outfits, I don't have much of anything. So I'm like really trying to think. And I was like, it was so funny. Peyton's about to leave for pre-game stuff. He leaves like really early. And I, it's like five, he's like getting ready. And I'm like thinking about it. I'm like, I don't know what I'm gonna wear tonight. And he's like, I have this white dress from House of CB. I think I wore it the first night. You guys would have seen it. I wore it the first night and to Zuma. And he's like, because I have that, or I have this like Daniel Guzio satin silk pink slip dress. And he's like, why don't you wear the white dress? I'm like, Peyton, into a basketball game? You think I'm gonna wear my white, my white dress? He's like, it's Miami, it's fine. I'm like, I can't wear my white maxi dress basketball game it's like so summery but like i can't it's also cold in those arenas like i get freezing i really have no idea what i'm gonna do also something else i've been on tiktok like like recently on tiktok i've been seeing 
this foundation, the Estee Lauder Double Wear Same Place Foundation, as like an ad. Like people have been doing it as an ad. Estee Lauder, if you want to, like, you know, work together, let me know. This is my favorite foundation, and I'm like so jealous of the people that are working with them because I genuinely love this foundation so much. I have quite a little bit of a sunburn or it could just be tan and maybe my foundation, let me check, I have a bit of a tan sunburn. When I haven't gone in the sun in a while, I tend to burn a bit, obviously, like us all. And I did, I underestimated myself. I thought I wasn't gonna burn. I got quite burnt. And it was my fault though, because I did not wear a single lick of sunscreen. I don't have too much time to be getting ready right now. It's also so hot here in Miami. I love it a lot. I've been back into my nude sticks Bondi I babe. Um, matte bronzer. I love this bronzer so much. It's like so good. Holy grail for sure. And then I'm really just gonna do cream blush after this. So I think I'm gonna end this little get ready with me. And I'll see you guys once I'm picking out my outfit, which is scary hours. <laughs> Thank you. guys i am back in boston so i'm ending my miami vlog here i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog i feel like i did a pretty good job vlogging this trip i hope i hope i hope i hope let's see what the footage is like i have no idea but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you guys so much for watching you guys are gonna see this and i feel like are gonna already know like the outcome of this series right now like the games obviously we won last night which was great. Um, so now like the series continues and we're going to game five tomorrow. So let's hope and pray, wish everyone luck. But yeah, I gotta end this off because I'm literally driving right now. Love you guys. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.